My name is Chester John D. Pasco. I am an alumnus of Cagayan Art College in my batch 2013. I graduated with my degree in Bachelor in Secondary Education major in English. Um, fortunately, I, I graduated as one of the cum laude during our time. Presently, I am connected with Corpus Christi School a private non-sectarian school here in Cagayan de Oro City. I am currently teaching in the senior high school department. I'm handling English subjects under the humanities and social sciences. Going back to my college experiences, it was not easy to live a life. Like You're forced to be an independent person at a very young age. Um, just a bit of a background. I, I come from a big family. We are 11 and uh, my father was a retired soldier, but though he's a retired military man, but we don't receive pension because of the loans that they had in the past and he's also sick. He has COPD and my mother is a plain housewife. She earns a living by doing laundry. And uh, so you can, they can barely send us to school, especially in college, it's expensive. But good thing, when I was in high school, fourth year high school to be exact, I received a letter from Cagayan de Oro College. And when I opened that envelope, I, I read that the school is granting me 100% scholarship. So, Though I, have, I, I, I did receive an allowance from the school as part of the scholarship grant, I could say that it, it was really never enough. It did not suffice. I had to give a portion of that allowance to my parents as a support. Fortunately, I, I met someone from another school who is also writing for a magazine, a local magazine, Cagayan de Oro. That's the, the Academic Tribune magazine. And she invited me to join the team. And that also helped me slither through success. Sometimes I get 500 or 800, but that's enough, at least, for me to, to supply my needs. I ventured into another racket during that time. So I started training girls who are into beauty pageants. So that's another source of income. And uh, there was a time that medyo minus good. And then I felt hopeless. But then I had to really go back to what really motivated me to, to pursue. And that is because I really want to live a better life. So my piece of advice to those students who are struggling in their college life at the moment, just never falter on your perseverance. Just be determined to achieve what, whatever it is that you really want to achieve in life. And uh, yes, problems are there. They are just natural. Pero kaya rin na siya. Okay? Sa ganyan pa nila, ka na mga problema, mga nagkatao, um, spices sa itong kilabuhi. So, achievement, uh, success, mas lamit siya kung miagi ka o daghan ng mga struggles sa kilabuhi. So, just continue. Never give up. 